More than 1,100 Russians were killed in Bakhmut in less than a week. Large number were wounded. Russian forces suffered more than 1,100 dead in less than a week of battles near the eastern Ukrainian city of Bakhmut, the focal point of fighting in eastern Ukraine, President Volodymyr Zelensky said. In less than a week, starting from the 6th of March, we managed to kill more than 1,100 enemy soldiers in the Bakhmut sector alone. Russia's irreversible loss right there near Bakhmut. Zelensky said in his video address. He said Russian forces had also sustained 1,500 sanitary losses. Soldiers wounded badly enough to keep them out of further action. Dozens of pieces of enemy equipment were destroyed, as were more than 10 Russian ammunition depots, he added. Russia's advance seems to have stalled in Moscow's campaign to capture the eastern Ukrainian city of Bakhmut, the Washington-based Institute for the Study of War said in an assessment of the longest ground battle of the war. Capture of the city would bring Russia slightly closer to its goal of controlling the whole of Donetsk region, one of four regions in eastern and southern Ukraine annexed by Russia last September following referendums widely condemned outside Russia as a sham. Institute for the Study of War said there were no confirmed advances by Russian forces in Bakhmut. Russian forces and units from the Kremlin-controlled paramilitary Wagner Group continued to launch ground attacks in the city, but there was no evidence that they were able to make any progress, Institute for the Study of War said.